Hi, this is Shanae with SBS Hair Studios, and I'm currently doing an updo's protective hairstyle on my client with cornrow braids. Nikki is currently growing her hair out from a short hairstyle, which we would have cut them before so you guys can see. Her hair is really growing at a fast pace. We said we were going to mention this. She likes to say it's the hair pills. I like to say it's my hands, the anointed hands. So we're going to go with the combination. Give her her way, give, give me my way. So right now what I'm going to do is, as you can see, I've already started her updo with a nice little decor, kind of sunrise. I'm doing an invisible start, which means I'm starting off the cornrow with her hair, her natural own hair. As I get a little section, a little ways up, I'm gonna go ahead and add the synthetic hair, the extensions, which will begin to help protect her hair. The purpose of the invisible start is so that I'm not pulling her edges out or her hair along the parameter of her hairline because the hair is being braided in the opposite direction of the natural hair growth which could cause some tension, which is tension alopecia. So to avoid all of that, I do the invisible start. As you can see, this is invisible, which means it starts with her hair, and then I'm gradually adding in the extensions. I'm adding in a particular amount of extensions, the size of them, because Vicki prefers to wear her hair in a nice, big, classy, messy bun. I know you're probably wondering, how do you get classy and messy all together? Well, we did. The final product, you'll be able to see the contour of her desired look. So as you can see, my coiling is pretty tight and close together as far as the coils going up, not regarding my parts. I'm gonna add, excuse me, Nikki. This last piece of hair is a lot fuller because I like the tail to be thick and long so that it promotes that bun that we want to do. Once again, this is Shanae with SBS Hair Studios. I'm doing a natural protective hairstyle, which is particularly just a common cornrow with a particular parting style to give her some chic effect to it. When I'm done, I'm going to dip the ponytail, and then we're going to loosen up the braids, unravel all of them, unravel them, ravel, excuse me, to give it a crinky look, a crinkly look, and have the full effect. At Styles by Shane, we're very versatile and multi-talented. I do not just do one particular thing, I do all things, except a jerry curl. This is 2014. However, check me out on Instagram at Styles by Shanae. And on Facebook, Styles by Shanae as well. And on my YouTube channel, Styles by Shanae. Or you can also check out Beyond the Chair Hair Magazine where I interview other stylists. And that would be under Shanae Reddick. And one thing I want to speak of about myself, just to give you guys a little extra. I am a stylist who is a multi-talented stylist. I do not do the same look every time. An artist is never duplicated. Therefore, she'll come back and ask me for the same look that I did the first time. <clears throat> not happening. Because my brain doesn't work like that. I do not remember the first thing I did. Even when she shows me a picture, it's just not in my database to sit up here and part it exactly the same. I have to give some creativity. So I'll holler at you guys later once I'm done um, swooping my girl up. And then you guys can check her out the final product. And we out.